27 degrees right now. Hot and dry, but I'm heading down on Sunday for opener on Wednesday. I'm gonna spend a couple days looking around, asking permission. That's the last one there. It's crazy. I'm uh, Brooks here. I'm just out uh, scouting out some elk here out uh, by your place here. And uh, I was just, uh, I seen your sign here. I was wondering if it would be possible to get permission if we see some elk in there to uh, go in and do some high and harvestable. One stand and sucks ass. <clears throat> this one's weak on his fucking second point, really weak. The one laying down? Yeah. Second one up? That one on the right from the standing up. Yeah, we're working our way right into the sun though. It's gonna be a little tricky. Two or three bulls. I just gotta, gotta find the third one. There, you hit him. He's in the front. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. Is that the one at the back? Yeah. Wait. <laughs> you just go down? Okay. Wait. Wait till he stops. He's down. 
Big bull down. Cover the distance. Prairie elk at its finest. About had enough of us. Okay, let's go see your bull down. Okay, we're gonna go video one down. Professional hunter, what do you know? Here, let me come around. Can't really complain about that. No, that's a nice. Uh, We've seen some bigger bulls, but. It is what it is, right? He's still kicking. That's a pretty nice bowl, though, really. That's uh. He was the best one of the works, right? That's way better than what Buddy shot. No. Huh? Think so? I think so. Well, here we are. So where are we here? Tell the viewers. Well, hunt. maybe you shouldn't. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot bigger bulls here, but whatever. This is a nice bull, really good representation of what was around. I mean, you know, this is probably a little better than average bulls that we saw uh, that were actually shootable. There's quite a few that we saw that were inside the base that were quite a bit bigger, but this group here just decided to not go back in and bed up in this little slough bottom back here. And we pulled the stock on them. There was some, a little bit of excess shooting, but... Uh, a little further than I thought it was, obviously. Still not a bad 6x6, six six, really. You know, he was the better one of all the other ones, so. He's probably maybe a three, four year old bull. Probably four. He'll be okay. Good it's... taste. We gotta deal with the meat right away because it's gonna be 30 degrees today. Big dagger on that side, eh? He's just a little weak on this one time, but everything else is solid. Nice bull. I'm happy. I would have liked to thump them like I usually do. <laughs> but, I, but I don't know, it was way further than I thought it was. Want to turn his head there and get behind him? Big bull down. Yeah, he's got nice big daggers and good sixth point here. I, th I think he was the best one of the works. I'm sure he was. September 5th. Yeah. There, I mean, there's no rutting activity whatsoever. All the bulls are, I mean, we've been seeing herds of 20 plus bulls. All together, all bachelor groups, like they're just coming out of velvet and the rut's only, you know, a couple weeks away. And, Cool. Nice nice critter. It's gonna be tasty. They eat the sagebrush and I think they'll be really good to eat. Well, here comes the backup rig. Cool. There you go. This is the way we do it in fucking Alberta.